Hello and welcome to Sunday's Financial News. And here's what's making the headlines in the markets today. The dollar-yen pair has performed a minor correction, gaining 0.1% in the last session. The ATR is signaling low volatility. The price of gold has performed a minor correction, gaining 0.1% in the last session. The CCI settles in the neutral area. Bitcoin has lost 4% in the last session and seems to have stolen the volatility from all other assets. The ATR is signaling high volatility. The Aussie dollar pair has shown slight gains in recent sessions, up 0.2% in the last session. The stochastic RSI currently dwells in the overbought zone. And now let's hear what our chief analyst picked up for us today. UK transport companies are being asked to bid to provide extra freight capacity to be used in the event of a no-deal Brexit. The Kiwi was the top performer against the US dollar last week with a rally of nearly 2% into the June close. Russia has agreed with Saudi Arabia to extend by six to nine months a deal with OPEC on reducing oil output. Those were today's major economic events and now moving on to world financial headlines. The German unemployment rate will be released on Monday at 7.55 GMT. The U.S. ISM manufacturing PMI Monday at 1400 GMT. The Australian RBA interest rate decision Tuesday at 4.30 GMT. The U.S. initial jobless claims Wednesday at 12.30 GMT. The U.S. ISM non-manufacturing PMI Wednesday at 1400 GMT. And the U.S. non-farm payrolls Friday at 12.30 GMT. We hope that you've enjoyed Sunday's Market Outlook and will tune in tomorrow morning for the latest events in the market.